Now we turn to Maryland and a dramatic rescue caught on camera. ABC's Morgan Norwood shows us what happened after a small plane crashed into an icy creek. John John Lean and his son saw this single engine plane crash into this creek south of Baltimore and knew they had to do something fast. Normally they're over there and this time he was heading right for us. <laughs> I do have multiple civilians with kayaks. It's pretty iced out. Uh, I stop over here. So the Navy veteran and his son grabbed two kayaks, knowing that every moment counts in such frigid water. You're pushing the whole ice flow, which is yeah. good. You just keep nice and slow. But the ice was so thick, they had to use shovels to paddle. I'm like, an oar's not going to do it. I need a shovel. When they reached the stranded pilot, 71-year-old Steve Crouchman, he was standing on the wing of the plane, sinking. They shouted instructions to him. Get out of the water. Just get out of the water and just hold tight. And then I just I just pickaxe backwards and got my kayak back onto the ice and he was out of the water. The father and son were soon joined by a police officer and a third kayak who helped get the pilot to safety, eventually pulling him onto this rescue boat. But dad doesn't call himself a hero. I don't look at it that way. I look at it just as someone who saw something that needed to do something. Uh, so I'm sore, so I'm sure he's, uh, he's pretty sore as well. Morgan Norwood, ABC News, New York.